Hello and welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we're talking about Far Cry 6. So this is the moment you've all been waiting for. What do I think of Far Cry 6? So I've been playing it for about six hours now. Um, so before this, if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe and let's get started with this. So yeah, I'm about six hours into this. Um, I've been playing around. Um, just, you know, like I'm really enjoying this game for the most part. Um, I don't really I don't really have anything negative to say about it um, and that's because this is a far cry game so if you've played other far cry games before then that's exactly what this is it represents everything far cry um, the difference with this one is so far in my in my time I've, I've finally gotten to this you know I've, I've been playing and I'm finally to this part where I can uh, where I can see my characters in a third person, um, in a third person perspective and run around this, uh, this little camp or whatever. Um, I really wish I had the choice to play first or third person. I mean, I get that this is a far cry game that tra traditionally been in the third or uh, first person view, but I would really like to experience this game in third person. I think that this world like exploring this world in third person would be freaking amazing so ubisoft if you're listening please allow us to do that give us a patch or something um now that i've seen this I, that's what i want I, I want i want a choice um you guys are going all out about whole choice and everything so uh yeah give us a choice on this one i would definitely love to explore this game in uh, third person camera that's the only nitpick I have at this point now. Um, that's not really a nitpick because I bought this game knowing that it was a first-person shooter. And now that I have this um, this taste of, you know, third-person camera for this, for this game, I would really love to experience this. So it's not necessarily a bad thing, but it definitely invokes that, um, that, that want for... It, it's it's going to leave me wanting now because of that. So Ubisoft, if you're listening to that, Please make this a possibility. I would really love to see this game in third-person view. Um, <clears throat> other than that, the visuals are freaking beautiful. Uh, the The voice acting so far has been great. I, I'm really enjoying the story, and the more um, the more gritty nature of this game is really freaking pretty cool. Like I'm I'm really digging it this time. Um, the missions, you know, they're, they're, they're the same type of missions that you're going to find in all Far Cry games. I mean, they're, you know, there's the over the over the top weapons and and other things, you know, like the the, the pet animals and stuff. But if you're a, if you're a freaking Ubisoft fan and you like Ubisoft games and you play Far Cry, like you're genuinely going to be pretty happy with this game for the most part. Not only is this probably, I think, the biggest map they've ever built for a far cry game because this thing looks pretty freaking huge <laughs> so um for the most part like it, it looks beautiful the detail is really high in this game uh the character models are great when you see the characters and like the you know like cutscenes or whatever they look freaking super highly detailed so i mean that's that's amazing so i mean it's like the fact that this is a cross-gen game and we get the version that looks this freaking good is pretty amazing. Like, this game looks pretty dang good for what it is. Um, you do have the option to download a 26 gigabyte um, HD texture pack. Um, I'm not going to lie. I can't really tell much of a difference from what I was playing last night before downloading that today before I started playing. Um, that... It still, it still look, but I, but I mean, it looks really good. Like no matter where you look, I mean, if you're up close to this thing, you can see some really fine detail. And not to mention the Dolby Vision support. Oh my gosh! So there is a way that you can literally compare exact pictures from HDR 10 and Dolby Vision on your games. And I, I stumbled upon this today. So I like to take screenshots while I'm playing my games, and I took a screenshot, and uh, I went to I went I went to to view it, and it like because it, it just it shows you just HDR, 
And I was like, wow, that's freaking, that's insane. Cause it doesn't look like that while I'm playing. And then when you switch back to the Dolby Vision, oh my gosh, yeah, this game is a dramatic, dramatic change in how the Dolby Vision works and looks on this game. I tried to take pictures with my phone of the screen, you know, between the different two. I mean, you can kind of tell, but at the same time, they both look, they both look pretty good. So you'd have to see this game in motion playing with the Dolby Vision. But I'm telling you, if you uh, switch over, if you take a screenshot and then you view it in the viewer before you go like go to send it or whatever, you can see the difference between the Dolby Vision and the HDR10 because the, the the screen capture will capture the HDR when you do that. So if there if that's something that you're interested in and want to see, boom, that that's pretty cool. So you can definitely do that. I, you, I'm pretty sure you could probably do that on on any game um that supports dolby vision so you can actually see you know hey man and and then you choose for yourself what looks better to me the dolby vision adds so much more clarity and so much more so much more color palette to the game that it looks great um i took a picture of the sun like the sunrise or whatever and and it just in in the hdr it's like the colors all blend together but then in the um, dolby vision there's like way more detail in the clouds way out to the horizon and everything it's amazing. So this is one of those games that definitely uses Dolby Vision. So if this, if that's something that you really want to see, definitely pick this game up. Um, would I recommend this game after what I've played on it? Yeah, definitely. This is this is great. Like it's it's pretty good. Well written. The characters in it are great. Um, even Shakira is in this. So <laughs> so it's pretty cool. Like yeah. Um, I definitely do recommend playing through this game. I mean, especially if you're a Far Cry fan. I don't necessarily see how you would go wrong with that. I'm having a good time. I'm having a blast. Um, I probably should have picked this up on the PlayStation 5 so that I could stream this gameplay. Um, but at the end of the day, I'm glad I didn't because I get to experience this in Dolby Vision now. And after seeing those, those pictures, yeah yeah dolby vision is definitely the way to go it looks much better way more clarity just like i've been saying so if you like this content don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you in the next one